Is it recording? It is. Okay. <laughs> it is right now. Oh. And if I set the if I set that whole roof back a little bit, um, and then somewhere around here is going to be a Honda motor. Um, Which one? The four cylinder. Yeah. It. Uh, I've I've got a. a Two thousand eight Civic. Yeah, this is a two pedal car. So this would be a North American automatic car. Looks like it's a brake pedal kind of up top and then down there is the gas pedal. But that's got a third pedal. It's got okay. two pedals hanging on the You can only assume that that's clutch brake and then the gas is on the floor. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. But Obviously, we're not used to the pedals being yeah, coming from down the ceiling, like yeah, that, that's you weird. know, rather than being all on the floor. Yeah, it just has the quad headlight feel. Whereas I think the European ones, they have like a full glass lens on the front of them. This could be one of the only manual two-door type tours that we see in our lifetimes, you know. It's almost like it's cut out like it's meant to it's be It's meant to be in the door? Oh. But it's not, but the window stops that from happening. Yeah. Yeah. Because Whereas this the time, quarter glass is much is much about it's, it's exactly the same spot. On that. Very interesting. It is There is a lot going on with this thing that I have never seen anywhere before. Including an extra alternator. And, it, and maybe they weren't even actually utilizing the generator at this point. Maybe the alternator was actually replacing the generator. Hard to know for sure, but... And then they've got this maybe reserve oil tank. Got a hard line that runs around back behind there and straight down into the oil just wild so steven almost bought this thing whenever before we left last time <laughs> no, it's like the at, last split window out here it's like what's the cheapest one you got and, like, oh. and, and steven stood here for like 10 minutes ago, like, i'd have to do a lot of work guys but i could do it it's not a fixer upper that's like you've got a parts bus for the bus you're gonna find well but let me tell you though have you seen the latest thing that irv restos uh took no. in Oh my God. I love it, dude. I mean, seriously, like, for anyone who likes mechanics, yeah, yeah. How can you not appreciate this? It's a little rough, especially down there. But as you get to this point, I love that. I think I'm gonna... What do you think, Stephen? What does this car need? Me. A front end. <laughs> a front end. Oh, yeah, that too. And, and a lot of time and money that I don't have. Right, yeah. Well. I'm getting it. But, man, that engine is, like, fairly complete. I'm seriously digging this. Minus the rodent droppings, but, you know. So, from, from 1978, when this was last on the road... Yes. It has stayed here this long without the engine being pulled or disassembled right this was just a, a used car not a classic yet when it was parked yeah and it's it's missing a few things but you can park it in tighter spots this way if you parallel park you can get in a shorter that's place. a good point yeah i didn't even really think about that now i've never seen this option before <laughs> I 
some kind of a pump or something, I think. I don't know what that's from, but you know, it's just living here in this little square back. Sometimes you look around, you see some crazy things and you think, well, I, at least I see, you know, what they were trying to accomplish with, you know, chopping up some metal. And other times, it's a little harder to figure out. <laughs> now, I think that probably they just couldn't get this to open and this was the solution. I'm pretty sure there could have been a better way. There it goes. Luck out and guess to the right size. Hmm. No, we did not. Didn't even fit over that. Yeah, I'm going to say that's like a 15. All right, we can come back for that. Might be worth editing out, you know, some of this. <laughs> or just do what I do, fast forward it, because they yeah. still like to watch him. <laughs> He's getting with it he out just, there. He just, he just whipped over to the mailbox. <laughs> you hear him? Oh, yeah. 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 All right, let's see here if I can. Okay, give it a twist. Um, so so I'll, I'll tell you when to stop because I want to grab it from both yeah. sides. Yeah, I think that's the right size. A little size. bit more. Yeah. Right there. Okay, I'm gonna try to. Okay, hang on. Okay, go. All right. Oh, come on, baby. Come on. Gotta be kidding. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's see what we get. So, St Stephen, we may have just talked ourselves out of him getting that gear after all. I don't think it did anything. Did it not? Is it recording? It is. Okay. <laughs> it is right now. Oh. screaming it oh my god they're cutting the puffer for no reason i don't feel great about this i really don't well, but here i'm gonna give you a little bit more on the there we go okay all right oh golly <laughs> there that went okay so the maybe... other side i'll just hold it yeah okay <laughs> hang on hang on hang on okay all right ready and let's see what i can do about holding it the most We're 
sorry, Volkswagen gods. Oh my God, yeah, that's, I, I, I feel even worse about it now. I really actually do kind of feel like an a-hole right now. It's really dinged up. It's yeah. rusty, it's dinged up. I mean, I, I feel bad, but I'm like. Honestly, it's no worse than the one that's on my car. But okay, all right, I'm, I'll get over it. There goes my day. Oh my God. I'll, I'll, I'll pay the homage for later. <laughs> You're gonna get nowhere with that. No, you ain't. Is that? No, you know you ain't. I won't bother going into the psychology of why I allowed myself to do this, nor throw anybody under the bus, no pun intended, for putting the idea in my head. I'm responsible. There's no way around it. Normally, I would have spent hours doing whatever I needed in order to not do something like that. Anyway, with that said, here's my bounty. Not only did I get a couple of reverse lights, but a handful of proper short lug nuts, and I also cherry-picked some of these 10mm screws. Not a bad haul.